I'm sorry, this internet connection abrupts you at a time where that's a devil function. It doesn't want me to share that valuable secret of the universe. And that as I was talking to you, that when I connect on your phone, only your phone bell rings and no other. How does that happen? That's technology, isn't it? So this is spiritual technology. When you put on a TV channel and only that Sony TV, if you want Sony TV, it comes on. Or times now, then it comes on. It is again controlling forces, the frequency, the energy. Every thought is a vibration, is a frequency. Vibration means frequency. Energy means frequency. So the whole universe is connected to each other via individual independent frequencies. And Shivani ji in a beautiful video was explaining, Jayant Kumar, welcome, how when we think of someone, and I was always saying this in my previous videos, if you remember, wherever attention goes, energy goes. Energy means frequency. So if my attention goes to Jayant Kumar, he will not know, but his subconscious mind will start connecting with me. Welcome, Tambi Saab, Vishnu. So I wanted to send my frequency, soul vibration energy to all you lovely friends whom in my heart, in my mind center, my third eye, I'm saying, I'm sorry. Please forgive me. I love you and thank you. I love you unconditionally and I thank you for loving. I'm saying this to myself just like Sunil Chai has taught me daily. Morning, day, like four times prescription medicine, tablets and to myself because I'm taking responsibility for what I've co-created. Anyway, coming back to our feelings, when we feel down, probably we do not know, but we are thinking of someone who is in the same frequency vibration and he's feeling low and that is being transferred to us. Because energy moves from one point to another point, wherever your attention goes, your focus goes. So think of all the happy people, the successful people, keep them in your mind, choose your thoughts. That's the secret which I'm learning. And I connect by taking my mind's eye, my soul's attention to such successful lovely cheerful happy people and their energy starts coming into my body and whenever i'm feeling down and Vic, and christy whitman whose student i am on laws of abundance is saying the same thing and that's the beautiful thing all these spiritual gurus are saying us the same message in different ways in different words yes deepak welcome now lakha i'm so happy to have you prashad Chaudhary, welcome welcome so as i was continuing you can watch it if you have joined late that it's all about frequency it's all about energy and wherever attention goes energy goes so keep your attention on positive thoughts on successful thoughts believe in yourself believe the law of abundance that you have to open your heart open your mind open your soul to believing that you're receiving it and you will start receiving it leave the how to the universe and the universe will will what is the word Con connect in such a way that events will start unfolding those people will probably Navalakha will start calling me Bhagavad will start calling me, Vishnu Tambe will start calling me and I want you to start expressing your thoughts on Facebook Live because when you are training somebody with your thoughts, actually you are training yourself. Everything is you, you and you alone. Upanishad says, Tattva Masi, you are the ultimate. We think that by chasing in the outside world we will achieve results. No, you have to cleanse yourself in the inner world. That's what Sunil Chai is teaching me daily. Why don't you attend his 11.30 live Facebook Live shows? He is teaching us such magic tricks, small techniques where you can cleanse your mind, you can start believing and keep positive energy flowing in your thoughts, in your self-talk. Am I right, Prashant? So please put your comments down and we would like to take this forward and explore the possibilities of changing our life circumstances. If you think of worries, you will get more of worries. If you think of sadness, you will get more of that because we attract what we think. It's like a boomerang. So it's so simple. All you got to do is replace your negative feelings with positive ones. And remember the days when you got those checks and how you felt or when you bought that new car or new house, how you felt. And that same feeling will generate more of it and more of those events will happen in your life. That's what Christy Whitman says in her Laws of Abundance. She is a wonderful lady. I see her thousands of videos on her channel, YouTube channel. I would recommend that if you want to change your life, Lokesh, welcome the one. And uh, I am now sitting down and instead of running around in the outside world, calling people, meeting them, trying to tell them, buy this, buy that. I am not doing all that. I am just working from my soul, sending the frequency vibrations for good things to happen in my life. And instead of thinking of human beings who are cheerful and maybe that energy can come. Why don't I think of those gods? Lord Krishna, he is the symbol of love, happiness, cheerfulness. Lord Ganesh for hard work, wisdom. And when I think of that, I start getting those energies. Energy, everything is energy, I said. Wisdom is energy. Creativeness is energy. Saraswati Devi, Gyan, knowledge, that is energy. Everything in any form is an energy. So I want to get those frequency videos 
I want to continue discussing this, but I don't want to keep talking to you all. I want you to tell me your problems and let's see if we can solve. Shri Kala, I'm so happy we connected. See my frequency. I was sending you vibes and I was thinking, why doesn't she come on my Facebook live or on Hangout? And there she is. Mohan Manjari, welcome. I think this is really a magic power that is each of us have inside us. Our inside is this power. We can understand it and practice it and see what we can do in the world. This please do join me and Sunil Chaya on these regular broadcasts. Thank you. Amazing. Wow.